One day after the mother of the six-year-old boy killed in a road rage shooting pleaded for justice at his memorial service, two people were arrested in connection with the boy's death. The California Highway Patrol said Marcus Anthony Ariz, 24, and Wynn Lee, 23, were taken into custody Sunday outside their home in Costa Mesa and are expected to be charged with murder. The fatal shooting of Aiden Leos, 6, occurred May 21 on State Route 55 in the city of Orange after Aiden's mother, Joanna Clunan, reported being cut off as she was driving her son to kindergarten. According to Clunan and those who stopped to help her, Clunan made a hand gesture to the car that cut her off, which then drove behind her, and someone fired into the car. Aiden, who was sitting in the back seat, was shot in the abdomen and later pronounced dead at a nearby hospital. She had to hold her little boy as he died, Aiden's sister, Alexis Clunan, said of the boy's mother immediately after the shooting. The freeway was shut down for hours after the shooting as investigators searched for evidence, and up to $500,000 was being offered as a reward for information leading to an arrest. On behalf of Border Division Chief Omar Watson and the Santa Ana area, we are deeply grateful for the professionalism and tireless commitment of our investigators who have worked on this case from day one to find those responsible for Aiden's death, said California Highway Patrol Commissioner Amanda Ray. It was unclear where Anthony and Wynn were being held, and whether they had attorneys who could speak on their behalf. Their relationship was also not immediately known. At the memorial service, Clunan said her son brought a insurmountable joy to her life. My heart melted every time he laughed and did the silly things he would do, such as breaking out into full dance mode every time he heard a song or when he would talk in silly voices, she said. Even though he could barely pronounce it, Aiden knew he wanted to become an entomologist one day, Clunan added. I want nothing more than to find justice, Clunan said. Although it won't bring you back into our arms it makes me outraged that such a precious, beautiful soul did not get the opportunity to continue developing into a young man and starting a family of his own one day while accomplishing his heart's desires. Contributing. Christine Fernando and Stephen Vargas, USA Today, The Associated Press.